a new DLC is coming. From the author of Become King of Riverhelm. Introducing Become the Jarl of Iverstead. The unexpected has happened. Alduin has returned from the shadows. His ferocious roar causes an avalanche which destroys the falcon nest. Dark days soon befall the people of Iverstead. But just when all is thought lost, a new hope arises. A savior appears and he's known by the name Dragonborn. Rebuild Iverstead beyond its former glory. Complete with 8 hours of immersive quest lines and more than 400 lines of recorded dialogue. Heavens, this can't be true. I thought the fortress was... was indestructible. Why, I even helped raise those great walls with these calloused hands. And Jarl Baramut, dead. My sword is sharper than the claws of a dragon. I am strong as a bear and fierce as a tiger. My men are brave and well-trained. Of course, all these virtues have a price, right? After all, how will I pay for the girls and for my sweet mead? <laughs> Bloodthirsty savages, brute ones, beasts. They paint their skin, dye their hair, and have a skull painted with blood on their face. From there, the name Red Skulls originated. They paint their whole body to become camouflaged in the vegetation. They are dangerous, so stay alert. Defend the lands of Riften from the Red Skulls' invasion.
become the Jarl of Iverstead. But is this where the journey ends? No, it is merely the beginning. Contract new servants to watch over your lands. To find the economy for your people. Such generosity. I thank you on behalf of the people of Iverstead. Upgrade Iverstead whichever way you see fit. Even expand your city. A new innovative system of prison management. Will you publicly shame those who have committed crimes? Shall you execute them? Will you handle the task of managing your prisoners? Torture them in cages? Maybe more directly. Or will you choose to free them? Your choices will have consequences. Become a benevolent leader. You rule at your people's best interest. You are a great leader. Good food and plentiful liquors, entertainment, justice. You've made a great government, Jarl. Low tax rates. Thank you for your generosity. Iverstead is in good hands. You have done a great administration, Jarl. You have my admiration. Or a cruel tyrant. Wow, this is cruel. All right, Jarl. I will command the guards to do the dirty work for you. Your tyranny seems to have no limits. Change while you can, Scrooge. Boo! Boo! Bastard. We starve while you are having fun with parties and events. I'm sure your noble table doesn't lack wine and meat. You rule Iverstead with an iron fist. Your day will come, tyrant of Iverstead. May I help you? Oh, my favorite tyrant. What can I do for you, your wickedness? And live by the consequences. Your bad administration has led people to revolt. The rebels are about to invade the castle, my Jarl. Of course, my Jarl. What product do you want me to import? Import and export to enrich your land. Mm, the delicious cheese from solitude. The worms in my tummy are hopping with joy. <laughs> your order will be delivered in the barrel of food. Your people consume a certain amount of food daily. Feed Apples, your people. Potatoes, meat, bread, vegetables. In other words, food in general. The garden produced more vegetables than we expected. The farmers are eager to know if they'll also have more food at the table. What do you think? Meet the demands of your people to satisfy them. Or not. Your wish is in order, Jarl. A warrior is causing tumult at the tavern. He claims to be the most valiant hero of Skyrim and wants to duel with the Jarl. What should I do? Ah, oh, such courage! It's going to be a pleasure to see my Jarl fight for the honor of Iverstead. Defend your honor in front of the crowds. Entertain them with events and games.
dine with the court. Hold feasts. Or simply relax. Govern the lands of Iverstead. Countless features. Only one designer. Some call him Leonardo Borges, but you call him Lowcaster. Iverstead awaits you.